Hey, Commander. What? No loco? <laughs> yeah, sorry. You okay? I don't know what I thought I'd feel coming back to Earth. I was ready to fight. Ready to die if I had to. But seeing everything like this... I know it's hard to see, but this is only temporary. But first we need to win this thing. Stay focused. Don't let them take your will to fight. I know, I know. You're right. So, I guess this is it, no? One more push, one last fight. Not necessarily our last. It's been an honor serving with you, Shepard. You're a good man and a terrific soldier. Thanks. Whatever happens out there today, I know you'll make me proud. That means a lot to me, sir. Hey, good luck out there, loco. Hey, Caden. Hey, Shepard. You ready? Absolutely. For anything. Bring it on. And Biotics Division? Your students? <laughs> More than ready. Eager. That's youth for you. Guess we're old soldiers. Hey, Shepard. Yeah. I guess we are. We know the score. We know this is goodbye. We're gonna win this thing. Don't get me wrong. I'm gonna fight like hell to see you on the other side. But listen, I... There's... Things I wanna say. I mean, looking back, I have a few regrets, but not many. That's pretty damn amazing, right? Messed up kid that I was. Never would have dreamed of the life I've had. And I owe a lot of that to you, you know? It's been quite a ride. It sure has. But how are you doing? Scared? Damn straight I'm scared. But that fear's gonna keep me alive long enough to strike these bastards right through the heart. Yeah. Exactly. So... Take care, Major. You too, Commander. Well... <laughs> I should find the rest of my squad. Yeah. You know, I've never been to London. <laughs> Yes, Commander. Is there someone you'd like to reach? Zaid Masani. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Almost thought you weren't gonna make it, Shepard. Glad I was wrong. You doing okay, Zaid? Yeah, yeah. Hope you've got one hell of a speech to get everyone moving. Looks like we might need it. Never seen anything like this. We don't stop it now. It gets worse. No kidding. Just doesn't feel like a real ground war when your opponents are taller than goddamn skyscrapers. Still, no use talking about it. Ready to go when you are. Let's cut the bastards. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Steve Cortez. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Commander, you made it. Glad I can say the same about you, Cortez. I've come too far to lose my pilot now. I apologize for that. Things got too hot. Thought maybe I could do another run and head back around. Well, not one of my finer moments. If I'd been flying my old trident, things might have been different. What matters is we took out that AA gun. Absolutely. And the Reapers are next. That's the idea. It'll happen. I'm just glad I can play a part. And Commander, thanks for making me believe again. If you hadn't, it helps to have reason to live again. Stay sharp, Cortez. Yes, sir. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Bigoto. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Hey, Shep. You ready down there? Depends on whether you got the crucible good to go. Always ready. 
No idea what it'll do exactly, but it's gonna be big. Good luck, Shepard. If you live through it, drinks are on me. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Jack. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Shepard? Shepard, is that you? Jack, how are you guys? Good so far. We're a ways south of your position. Rodriguez actually tore that little shoulder head off one of those Batarian things. It was great. I'll see you on the other side. I won't let you down, Shepard. Go kick some ass. You too. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Samara. Certainly. I'll connect you now. I wondered if I'd see you again, Samara. It's past time I joined your battle. You helped me a great deal in the monastery, Shepard. Thank you for returning the favor. Only your actions will be remembered. May you choose them well. Farewell. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Grunt. Certainly. I'll connect you now. About time you got here, Shepard. Didn't want to win this thing all by myself. Good to see you back in action, Grunt. Wouldn't miss it. Shepard. Yeah? Thanks for getting me out of that tank. Sure, Grunt. It's been an honor. Same here, Shepard. Okay. Grunt out. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Jacob Taylor. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Shepard, that you? Jacob, holding up? <laughs> Kicking ass, more like. My kill count's through the roof. We'll meet and compare notches when this is over. You got it. There's this, uh, great little bar in Rio we have to check out. I'm holding you to that. Give him hell, Jacob. Yes, sir. Shepard out. Is there someone else I can connect you to? Miranda Lawson. Certainly. I'll connect you now. Commander, hope you don't mind me crashing this little party of yours. Not at all. Feeling better? Much. I got a few sideways looks from Alliance Brass when I offered to help. They can't be choosy at this point. I'm glad you made it. Shepard, I, I wanted to say goodbye. Goodbye? If we both come back from this at all, everything will be different. Sure, everything will change. But on our terms, we've been running until now, Miranda. It has to stop. I understand. This isn't goodbye. You have to believe we're not done yet. Listening to you, I can believe it. Good. And Miranda? Yes? Be careful. I promise. And you too, Shepard. Is there someone else I can connect you to? I'm done. Yes, sir. I want you to coordinate with the Alliance. Make sure we iron out these logistical problems. Yes, sir. The Krogan don't want to share supplies. That's just Rex playing hard to get. Tell him I've got a crate of Denorian beer I'd be happy to barter with. <laughs> and that ought to get his attention. Shepard. So I guess this is just like old times? <laughs> huh. Might be the last chance we get to say that. Think we're gonna lose? No, I think we're about to kick the Reapers back into whatever black hole they crawled out of. Then we're going to retire somewhere warm and tropical and live off the royalties from the vids. I'll meet you there. I think my days of saving the galaxy are over when this is done. Be sure to leave room for all the autographs. <laughs> just need to beat the Reapers to get there. James told me there's an old saying here on Earth. 
May you be in heaven half an hour before the devil knows you're dead. Not sure if Torian heaven is the same as yours, but if this thing goes sideways and we both end up there, meet me at the bar. I'm buying. We're a team, Garrus. There's no Shepard without Vicarian, so you better remember to duck. Sorry, Torians don't know how, but I'll improvise. And Shepard, forgive the insubordination, but this old friend has an order for you. Go out there and give them hell. You were born to do this. Deal. the casualties they haven't brought in many more wounded that's something how are you holding up Liara this is it isn't it yeah this is it I don't know what to say I just know I'll have a clever line five minutes from now I do have one thing for you, Shepard. A gift. It'll only take a moment, if you want it. Sure. I've got a moment. Close your eyes. Let's do what needs to be done, Shepard. What's his condition? Bleeding. There's a lot of blood. His leg was blown off by the knee. Okay, and I'll try to stay calm. in your time? Worse. I have been listening to the Krogan speak to his men. In our cycle, the races never came together. There was no rallying cry. 
I envy you. Really? There's not much left out there. The future is still out there. It is something my people could never say. There will be a tomorrow. Only if we win today. No one else has ever made it this far. You came a long way, Javik. Better than anyone else here. And I look forward to fulfilling my mission. But you are now the avatar of this cycle. The exemplar of victory. Not just for humanity, or Turians, or Protheans, but for all life. Every soul that has ever existed is watching this moment. <laughs> well, no pressure when you put it that way. Do not waver. Victory is never won without difficult choices. I know. I've had to make a lot of those. There may be more. But I know you will see this through for all of us, no matter the cost. If we actually pull this off, what'll you do afterwards? Seeing the past again in the Echo Shard, the faces of my men, I will go to the Cronian Nebula, and I will find their graves. I will put their ghosts to rest, and then I will join them. You mean? It is as it should be, Commander. The last Prothean voice has spoken. There is no more left to say. Here. This shard is now yours. Add to it. The progeny of this cycle will study it. They will know this was the day when the Reapers were no more, and that you were their conqueror. Shepard, you did it. No matter what else happens today, you did what no one else could. You united a galaxy. That's a victory right there. And don't worry. I know why you're going to win. Because you brought the Krogan. Oh, and Bakara sent her regards. She's already pregnant. There are benefits to being a clan leader. But she keeps insisting we name the first one Morden. Anyway, let's get to it. Commander? Admiral? Just going over the sit rim. How's it look? Barely 50% of Hammer has reported in. Can we count on more making it? There's some stragglers still en route. But the bulk of Hammer that's still intact has arrived. We're as ready as we're likely to get. Every minute wasted here, the Reapers gather strength. Exactly my thoughts. Battalion leaders, report to HQ. We fought hard to get here, but now the toughest part of our mission begins. We've got to drive right through the heart of Reaper-controlled territory, break past their defenses, and get to that beam. What kind of defenses? The entire area is crawling with Reaper forces. But our biggest concern is the destroyer, protecting the beam itself. Can we bring in air support to deal with it? Negative. Some kind of interference. We'll have to take it out from the ground. Now they've cut a swath of no-man's land through the city. We'll have to cross that first. There'll be some limited shelter on the other side, but expect heavy ground resistance. We need to get our tanks to here, if we get close enough. We've got a shot at taking that thing out. How much of a shot? They know we're coming. This will be a one-way trip for many of us, but there can be no retreat, no stepping back. We move forward at all costs, understood? Who yeah. yeah. Yes, sir. Johnson, Coates, you two will coordinate the artillery units. Shepard, I'm sending you right up the gut where the resistance is heaviest. Support the tanks the best you can, but stay alive. I need you for the final push to the beam. I'll give you a minute with your squad. Pick your team well. This war has brought us pain and suffering and loss. But it's also brought us together as soldiers, allies, 
friends. This bond that ties us together is something the Reapers will never understand. It's more powerful than any weapon, stronger than any ship. It can't be taken or destroyed. The next few hours will decide the fate of everyone in the galaxy. Every mother, every son, every unborn child. They're trusting you, depending on you to win them their future. A future free from the threat of the Reapers. But take heart. Look around you. You're not in this fight alone. We face our enemy together. And together, we will defeat them.
here, Commander. Damn it! Kilo Company's being rooted!
Major, what's the situation? The beam's interfering with missile guidance. We can hit the destroyer, but we'll never make the precision strike we need to take it out. Damn it. Edie, can you read me? Yes, Commander. Any suggestions? I may be able to use the Normandy systems to enhance the missile's targeting capabilities. Excellent. I'll need you to open a link to the Normandy from the missile systems. On it. That's it. I'll let you know when I've adapted the targeting systems. Sounds like good news, Commander. We'll see. Hammer, this is Admiral Anderson. The Reaper ground forces are making a push. Hold your ground. Protect those tanks until we can get a shot. You heard it, people. Get ready. There they are! In there, soldier. Heads up! We've got more incoming. Watch our left flank. You heard her. Back to the truck, people. Missile guidance enhanced. Fire it. Countering interference. Did it hit? What happened? The Reaper is still too close to the beam. We're down to two missiles. And we haven't even scratched it. You will need to allow the Reaper to move out of the beam's influence. And closer to us. Commander, hammer is being overrun at every turn. Reaper ground forces are converging on your location. We're fighting our way to you. Hold on, Commander. Hold on. Kila, how can there be more of them? Hold on, everyone. We can do this. We're about to find out. Here they come. <laughs>
Roger that, Edie. Targeting is online. Reaper is within range. with everything you've got. Destroyer terminated. Nice work, Edie. Jeopard. We're on to your location. Jeopard. Over here. Thank God you made it. It didn't look good. It gets worse. Of course it does. Hackett just reported in. Several Sovereign class Reapers, including Harbinger, have broken off from the battle with Sword. They're headed here. Harbinger? It's an opportunity for Hackett to get the Crucible in place. But we have to get a team on board the Citadel to open those arms now. We still don't even know what we'll find when we get to the Citadel. Then that's our job. Find out what we're up against. All right. Saddle up, everybody. Get me Admiral Hackett. Here on in, it's a straight shot to the beam. A straight shot with Reapers trying to crush us along the way. We just need to get a handful of troops through. That all? We knew this was going to be a gamble at best. Can't think of anyone else I'd rather do this with. Feels like this fight's always been ours to finish. We're in sight of the target. All right, everyone. This is it. Shit.
need an evac. Right now. Argue with me, Tally. Don't leave me behind. I need you to make it out of here alive, Tally. Get back to Rannick. Build yourself home. I have a home. Come back to me.
Shepard. Shepard. Anderson. You up here too? here to be processed. Get too far ahead of me. Where do you think you're at? Just found that chasm you were talking about. Hold on. I see something. A control panel, maybe. I'm just gonna go on. Anderson! Anderson. is the means to survival, control of the Reapers, and of you, if necessary. Mm. They're controlling you. I don't think so, Adam. Controlling me is a lot different than controlling a Reaper. Have a little faith. When humanity discovered the mass relays, when we learned there was more to the galaxy than we imagined, there were some who thought the relays should be destroyed. They were scared of what we'd find, terrified of what we might let in. But look at what humanity has achieved. Since that discovery, we've advanced more than the past 10,000 years combined. And the Reapers will do the same for us again, a thousandfold. But... Uh, uh, only if we can harness their ability to control. Bullshit. 
bullshit. We destroy them, or they destroy us. And waste this opportunity? Never. You're playing with things you don't understand. With power you shouldn't be able to use. I don't believe that. If we can control it, why shouldn't it be ours? Because we're not ready. No. This is the way humanity must evolve. There's always another way. I've dedicated my life to understanding the Reapers. And I know with certainty the Crucible will allow me to control. <clears throat> and then what? Look at the power they wield. Look at what they can do. I see what they did to you. I took what I wanted from them, made it my own. This isn't about me or you. It's about things so much bigger than all of us. He's wrong. Don't listen to him. And who will you listen to, Shepard? An old soldier stuck in his ways, only able to see the world down the barrel of a gun? And what if he's wrong? What if controlling the Reapers is the answer? If we destroy the Reapers, this ends today. But if you can't control them... But I can! Are you willing to bet humanity's existence on it? I... know it will work. You can't, can you? They won't let you do it. No! I'm in control! No one is telling me what to do! Listen to yourself! You're... indoctrinated! No! No! The two of you so self-righteous! Do you think power like this comes easy? There are sacrifices! You've sacrificed too much. Shepard, I... I only wanted to protect humanity. The Crucibles can control them. I know it can. I just... It's not too late. Let us go. We'll do the rest. I... I can't do that, Commander. Of course you can't. They own you now. You... You'd undo everything I've accomplished. I won't let that happen. You're nothing more than the Reaper's plaything now. Now! You're the one who failed! You could see it like I do, Shepard. It's so uh, perfect. This is it, everyone. The arms.
Commander? We did it. Yes, we did. It's uh, quite a view. <laughs> Best seats in the house. God. Feels like years since I just sat down. I think you earned a rest. Anderson? Mm. Mm. Stay with me. We're almost through this. You did good, son. You did good. I'm proud of you. Thank you, sir. Anderson? Sure, how to. Commander! Citadel was the catalyst. No, the Citadel is part of me. I need to stop the Reapers. Do you know how I can do that? Perhaps. I control the Reapers. They are my solution. Solution? To what? Chaos. Created will always rebel against their creators. But we found a way to stop that from happening. A way to restore order. By wiping out organic life? No. We harvest advanced civilizations, leaving the younger ones alone. Just as we left your people alive the last time we were here. But you killed the rest. We help them ascend, so they can make way for new life, storing the old life in Reaper form. I think we'd rather keep our own form. No, you can't. Without us to stop it, synthetics would destroy all organics. We've created the cycle so that never happens. That's the solution. But you're taking away our future. Without a future, we have no hope. Without hope, we might as well be machines, programmed to do what we're told. You have hope. 
more than you think. The fact that you were standing here, the first organic ever, proves it. But it also proves my solution won't work anymore. So now what? We find a new solution. Why are you telling me this? Why help me? You have altered the variables. What do you mean? The crucible changed me, created new possibilities, but I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. But be warned, others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. But the Reapers will be destroyed? Yes, but the peace won't last. Soon, your children will create synthetics, and then the chaos will come back. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. So... The elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can. You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. Hmm. There is another solution. Synthesis. And that is? Add your energy to the crucibles. The chain reaction will combine all synthetic and organic life into a new framework. A new DNA. I... Don't know. Why not? Synthetics are already part of you. Can you imagine your life without them? And there will be peace? The, the cycle, cycle will end. The Reapers will cease their harvest, and the civilizations preserved in their forms will be connected to all of us. Synthesis is the final evolution of all life. The paths are open, but you have to choose.
I am alive. All of us, synthetic and organic, have been changed. The war is over, and the Reapers are helping to rebuild. Where once they threatened us with extinction, they now bring us the collective knowledge of the cultures that came before. As a galaxy, we can now live the lives we have wished for. Taking our first steps into a new and wonderful future, where organics and synthetics can coexist peacefully. With peace across the galaxy and with unlimited access to knowledge, to recover the greatness that was lost. and surpass it. We will reclaim our worlds and the stars as the line between synthetic and organic disappears. We may transcend mortality itself to reach a level of existence I cannot even imagine. And we will remember that this chance for a new life did not come without cost. No matter how far we advance, we will remember the sacrifices of those who made it possible. And we will remember Shepard. Because of him, I am alive. And I am not alone. Did that all really happen? Yes, but some of the details have been lost in time. It all happened so very long ago. When can I go to the stars? One day, my sweet. What will be there? Anything you can imagine. Our galaxy has billions of stars. 
each of those stars could have many worlds. Every world could be home to a different form of life. And every life is a special story of its own. Tell me another story about the shepherd. It's getting late, but okay. One more story.